Good morning, Tiana. Good morning. Are you ready for our trip today? Yeah. Woohoo! We just have to finish getting ready, finish our breakfast, and then we'll be on the road. We are getting ready to head to Pittsburgh, which is where we'll be spending the night before we get on our flights to head to Antigua. And I'm just doing a little bit of last minute packing stuff up that we had laid out yesterday. Then we're gonna hit the road, but we're a little bit nervous because the visibility and air quality is really bad because of the smoke from the Canadian wildfires, thinking about everybody who's been affected by those fires. Um, so we don't know how this road trip is gonna go or what we're gonna be able to do in Pittsburgh. But either way, we're gonna head up there. We have a hotel room for the night and John's upstairs finishing getting ready. So I'm gonna try to finish packing and then get the car packed up. So we're going to do what I'm there. There's a surprise. Come on. Uh, on my scooter. Yes, Tiana got new luggage. Can you show them under there the surprise luggage? Okay. Tiana got new luggage and this actually goes on her scooter so she can scooter through the airport and then have a scooter when we get to our destination. Wow, that's so cool. This is your first time having your own luggage. John! Yeah! Are you ready to go? Yeah, I'm almost dressed. Okay. Okay, all packed up, almost ready to go. We have my bag, John's bag, Tiana's suitcase, and then we have my purse and Tiana's purse, backpacks for the airport. And then this stuff is just for the car ride, and we all have our shoes that we're wearing today. One thing I packed that I never thought I'd have to pack again, let me show you, masks. Because of the air quality thing, they said you might have to wear a mask when you go outside in Pittsburgh. The air is actually very bad here in Charleston as well. The visibility is poor and we haven't been able to spend time outside since yesterday. But I heard the further north you go, the worse it is. So we're going to bring our masks just in case. Are you guys ready? I need to go help them. made it halfway to Pittsburgh. We are at stop number one, Kroger. The smoke is getting much worse the further north we drive. I don't think you can see it in the videos, but it is pretty smoky. We got them. Come on, taste Vegan. Mommy, hold this. Wait, you want to eat them right now? Uh -huh. In the store? Ish, we won't tell anybody. Uh-oh, you guys aren't supposed to do that. Is anybody looking? I'm looking. Good. <laughs> she likes them? Yeah, she likes them. All right, well, she only needs one, so we're just going to put the rest of these back. <laughs> no. 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 Now it's a party. <laughs> she said that's not vegan. <laughs> And we got some peanut butter for airport sandwiches. Yep, nothing like a peanut butter and jelly. That is interesting. All right, now you got the money. Let's go. Let's get out. So if you're new here, you're probably wondering, did they just feed their four-year-old cupcakes before noon? Yes, sometimes we do that, but don't worry. We also feed her things like ice cream and candy and things as well. It's not just cupcakes. Chill out. <laughs> we go pee -pee. Oh, now she has to go pee-pee because we came out of the store. She didn't have to pee when we were in the store, only when we get out of the store. Does that make any sense to you? <laughs> Does that make any sense to you? Yeah. Makes no sense to daddy. All right, so you go in and go pee. Me and mommy will wait here. You're four. You can do it on your own. Fine. I don't I so calm and quiet in this car now without my two noise boxes. All better? Yeah. Oh, are you okay? She's exhausted because she had to walk all the way there and all the way back. He wouldn't understand. <laughs> While we're driving, I wanted to take a second to talk about screen time because John and I used to be those parents before we were parents that said we would never let our children have screen time. We thought we were gonna do no TV, no phones, no tablets, 
no nothing like that. Um, and they were just gonna like play with wooden blocks, which is great, but that didn't work for us because of our lifestyle and because we truly believe that technology is the future and teaching your kids to responsibly use technology at a young age will help prevent issues in the future. So we do think screen time is good in moderation and it's especially helpful on travel days. And that leads me into talking about today's video sponsor, Google, and more specifically about Google Guidebooks. So if you haven't heard of Google Guidebooks before, you don't know what they are, are their visual resources that are helpful and easy to follow to teach you about different Google products. And today I wanted to talk about the Family Link Guidebook since we are chatting about internet safety and online time. We love the Family Link Guidebook because it teaches you how to set digital ground rules for your children as they explore, play, and learn online. Tiana is at that age where she's getting more independence and really learning how to navigate her screens. Um, so we have to set rules and set guidelines and also learn how to kind of control that but give her some freedom as well. Google Guidebooks give you lessons to follow. So for example, if you're trying to learn how to do something in Family Link, you click on the Family Link Guidebook and go to Lessons and then you pick the lesson that associates what you're trying to learn. And then it gives you very clear step-by-step -step instructions that literally anybody could follow to learn how to do what you're trying to do or learn about something new. And if you're not a parent, there are many different Google Guidebooks on different Google Google products that could help you with whatever you're doing or interested in. So I highly suggest checking it out. I'm gonna leave a link right here in the video and also one down below. Just give it a click and you can get started learning on Google Guidebooks today. Thank you again, Google, for sponsoring this video. Now back to the drive. We are almost to Pittsburgh. The air looks crazy now. Rihanna is obsessed with the smoke in there. It's air quality. She's like checking the air quality every five seconds and seeing like where it's at. She thinks she's gonna die soon. I'm having symptoms. Yes, Tiana? Okay, I'll help you. Oh, you're trying She's to She's having that. symptoms. No, I, I'm stressed out. The air is so bad. You can see the smoke. I'm stressed out. The air quality is dangerous, which is like the highest level it can be. And it says don't be outside even for a few minutes. Well, good thing we're inside in the car. I don't think that's the same as inside. And I brought our masks. But now I found out we're supposed to have N95 masks and I brought regular masks. And we have to get gas. Stop, stop it. Cover your nose, baby. Why, what's clear now? There's smoke in the air. Mommy's being dramatic. No, I'm serious. I can't remember. Really crazy, babe. I, it's like really crazy. Are you gonna get out and pump gas? Nope. I'm just gonna wait until we run out, and then at least we're safe from the smoke. Even if we're stuck in the middle of the highway, <laughs> pump gas. just got into Pittsburgh. We're at the Grand View Overlook. We all have our masks, so we're just gonna take a quick peek over the edge before we head to our hotel. It's been a while since I've worn one of these. Is there a hotel? Yeah, now we're going to the hotel. You gotta keep your mask on though, okay? No, I can't bring it. You, you can't can... bring it? Yes, you can. I like the tea. Keep your mask on, okay? Okay. Just in case. Oh, wow, go look. No, I don't look. Whoa. What happened? It's the smoke from the wildfires in Canada. Not good. Not good, huh? You can barely no. see the city. Yeah. No. Pretty crazy. I don't know. A fire cause cause a volcano. Oh, from a volcano, you think? You think a volcano exploded near here? Really? Yeah, how am I mad? Now we're gonna head to the hotel. Um I didn't oh, feel yeah. anything from the smoke, like, but I did have a mask on. Do you feel anything? <laughs> Stop. This is so intense and we're pretty far away from Canada, so I can't even imagine what the people who are actually there near the wildfires are going through. So we're sending our best wishes to them. Hopefully this all is over soon. I hope the fire stops. 
Me too. Our bar and restaurant is open till 10. And then the restaurant reopens at 6 a.m. Can we taste them? Right now? Can you find it by yourself? Yeah. Four. You found it! Oh, really? At the end, maybe it's a sweet. Maybe it's a sweet, sweet. All right, here you go, baby. Welcome to Oh my sweet. God! Oh my God! I has to eat, and I really love it. I said, how about this? It's actually really rare to get a towel oh, backsplash wow. in your shower. That's real, too. Is it a dad tour? Do you want to go to sleep? <laughs> do you want to go swimming? Let's do it. Are you the captain of this ship? No, good ship. Your hands about to the seal, man. Can you push the button? This one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh. To the top. Woo! Uh oh, your mermaid tail's driving. We took baby girl down to the lobby. We were ready to go swimming, and they said the pool is closed for renovations. And before you ask if it says it on the website, probably, but we always book through Expedia, and it did not disclose that. So we promised baby girl a pool. She's a little upset, understandably, so we're gonna actually switch hotels. I think all we need is the luggage carrier, and she'll just have a blast. Uh-huh. Okay, I'm putting stuff under you, okay? So don't don't um jump down on it. Isn't this fun? This is so chaotic. We could have just like powered through for a night, but we've all been like wanting the pool all day and like saying we're going to the pool, we're going to the pool, we're going to the pool, so we're gonna find a pool. My heart was broken for her when we got down there and she said the pool is actually closed. And I was like, oh no. Bye hotel room. It was nice for the 15 minutes. We enjoyed you. Hey, little mermaid girl. <laughs> you did your tail. You did your tail in the air. You ready to go get some food? I guess that's a no. <laughs> All right, you stay here, we'll go get some food. All right, see you later. We had a successful swim session. What did you think? Good, I got my hair wet. You did get your hair wet and then we rinsed it and I just realized that we don't have our masks on. We're heading to Chipotle to get some dinner. And then she's gonna get fries from Five Guys Fries and I've actually haven't had those in a long time. I know, we should all share them. Those so I'm probably gonna fries. eat a few of them. And then um, we're gonna try to get back early tonight and call it an early night because our flight's so early in the morning. Early, early, early. Um, but John's Say, gonna get Say, let's go eat. And John's gonna get a special dessert after dinner. <laughs> She's snapping. She's snapping. <laughs> the guacamole? Oh. So we just did that thing where we went too long without eating and then we were starving. So we ordered a bunch of different food and ate too much, too fast. That was really good. I love Chipotle and every time we eat it, I'm like, we should eat this more. Well, the bad news is we still have to go to the milkshake factory because it's one of my favorite places to eat here. Okay, first we're gonna go to Walmart because John forgot his sunglasses. So we're gonna go get sunglasses and then hopefully we have room for a milkshake. <laughs> hey baby girl. Are you going to put the phone down or are you just going to let everybody in the comments judge us? Perfect. Did you find sunglasses? 
I can't pick. Okay, try mom. My head's too small. We'll pick. No, it's not. Don't You're laugh. Paranoid. Yeah. <laughs> I said, don't laugh. All right, you tell me which ones you like. Okay. This one. Or this one. I show you all that love, and that's how you repay me. Daddy has a small head. I don't know what to do. I need kids' sunglasses. I don't think you have a small head. I think you're just weird about sunglasses. No, okay. my head's like near. I don't think it's a small head, but it's a narrow head. So <laughs> these stick all the way out like this, no. like I'm directing airplane traffic or something. Okay, try the other ones. One more time. Uh, definitely those ones. Definitely those ones. Yes, those look good. Yeah. Tell them in the comments. Those ones look good. Uh, oh, good. These are the ten dollar ones. This is first place. You know what for? Being the best daughter ever. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> All right. Do you want to go find your activity for the airplane? Uh, so we're trying to get her to get like an art kit or something like this to keep her busy for our four hour flight. But of course she wants a toy. So how do we make a art this kit? Is... You want that? Uh-huh. Oh, that's a magic marker perfect. kit. Perfect. That's actually perfect. Uh, I want to try it out. Well, remember it's for the airplane, but would you like no, to- No, try it out. Would you like to try one tonight? This is what you want? Uh -huh. This is actually really good. This is perfect. We get both of these. Yeah. What do you this, think? This is the day. You want to do Bluey tonight, and then you can do Paw Patrol tomorrow on the airplane? Yes. Is that a good idea? We'll do it today. Okay. This, this All right. We got to carry them to the front and pay for them. Okay. All right. We'll take it. We have to get Tiana something to eat for breakfast in the airport because everything's going to be closed, and she's definitely no. She'll be fine. She can she can eat on Saturday. We <laughs> like. No, no, okay. <laughs> actually, actually, I have fish fry in the car. You, you do. have french fries in the car, but I don't think you're going to want to eat those for breakfast. <laughs> I'll be so yucky. You ready to go pick your breakfast? So self-conscious about my sunglasses. No, those look really good. I love those. Seriously. I wouldn't let you get bad looking sunglasses. You think I'll pick up any ladies at the beach? I think so. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't say anything. I chose Tiana's breakfast, Fruit Loops, and real fruit. I feel like that's the definition of balance right there. Guys, the smoke is so bad. You're so funny. Are you gonna color while you're walking? I actually like it. That's that's pretty talented. I know. Wow. Look, Look at guys. You. Milkshake factory. We finally made it. This is the whole reason John's on this trip. They're so good. You guys stay out here. I'm gonna get me one. <laughs> no. I wouldn't leave you, but I will leave mommy. <laughs> Tiana um, has vanilla soft serve with Oreos. This yum, is yum. daddy's taste test, not Tiana's. <laughs> shh, shh, I need silence. Yeah, it's a 10 out of 10. Milkshake factory, dairy free. That's where it's at. Cookies and cream. So me had cat on them. You want I didn't get my own because I know she had finished this, so. I think she likes it. <laughs> Can I have a bite? Oh, you got the airplane and everything. Oh my god. You know the food's good when it makes you bust a move. Good morning, it is 3.40 a.m. Way too early to be awake, but we're getting ready to head to the airport. John just took a load of luggage down to the car. Well, actually like all of our luggage and the hard part is about to come because we're about to wake up Tiana and she's not an early bird. Oh, I love in the morning when she's a little cuddle bug. Are you ready to go to Antigua? Yeah? Okay. No, thank 
All right, so we just parked for the airport, and Rihanna said we parked in economy, and I said, oh, what's the difference between economy and the other one, the extended <laughs> stay? And she said, it's because we have to walk to the airport. There's no shuttle. Guys. You can't even see it from here. But guess how much money we save? How much? Two dollars a day, and for 14 days, that's twenty-eight dollars. That's why I married you. <laughs> We were on our way to the gate and we found the coolest kids place I've ever seen in an airport. Okay, ready? All right, pedal. Oh, hold on, daddy's leg's stuck. I can't fit. Whoa! She left me, she left me over there all by myself because I couldn't get it going. <laughs> Now you're up and you're stuck. We made it to Antigua. We got our rental car, Woo! which you can see is right side drive. I can't look at you guys right now because <laughs> everything is backwards. We're driving on the left side of the road. This is extra crazy. What do you think of Antigua so far? I make a pizza. Oh, <laughs> delicious. Take that. Tiana's ready to swim. We need to grab some food and then we're gonna head to the hotel. You guys <laughs> You got random customers telling me y'all call me. I was like, why is he talking to me? What is wrong no, with you? No, we were hiding. In the produce? Y'all look crazy. You. Look around. 